welcome back and in today's video we are going to do a review of the T-Bone 3, the 15 ounce stiletto hammer. This hammer costs $275 on average. Maybe you can get a little bit cheaper and we're gonna see if it's worth it. Let's get into it. Okay, I know what you guys are thinking. Um, $275 is a lot of money for a hammer, especially when you can go to Home Depot and get a Vaughn for like $35. I know a little more expensive than they used to be. Inflation. But still, that's still a lot of money for one hammer. And my thought process is when I first started as an apprentice, I was only making about $400 a week. And so I would not invest almost two thirds of my check into a single tool like this. But as time has gone on and I've made a little more money, I have the ability to invest in myself. And that's why I purchased this hammer right here. I know a lot of guys will go to the bar or they'll buy guns or they'll invest in shoes, but they won't invest in their own tools. And so I thought, I'm gonna make a video just kind of going over why I like this hammer and why I think it's right for me and make my right for you. So let's talk about it. This hammer is full titanium, which I like because you don't have a point of failure. Like if you had a wood handle hammer, like this other stiletto I had, this is great but sometimes I'm asked to strip form work or do demo work. And so if you really put your weight behind this hammer right here and have to pull, this, this, this wood handle wants to come loose from the hammer head. And so it might crack or break. And so that's a chance of the hammer head flying off or breaking. And if I'm on the sixth floor or the 12th floor of a building, I don't want to have to stop what I'm doing and then grab another hammer out of the connex or out of my bucket, wherever it's placed. I like the fact that this is reliable. I don't, I'm not worried about what I'm doing. Whatever task I'm doing, uh, as long as it's not like extreme finish work, I can take this everywhere, whether it be framing, siding, concrete form work, demo, uh, stripping, uh, stripping and setting stuff. This is the perfect overall hammer that I can take everywhere no matter what I'm doing and I'm fine I really enjoy that the fact that this has this little uh, nail puller on the side I did not expect to use that as much as I do um, it's kind of gimmicky you think at first but obviously you get a lot more leverage and oomph from the side pull and that definitely comes in handy a lot more than I expected sometimes there's places where the claws aren't really doing the job and you can start off with the side pull and finish it off with the uh, the claws works great every time. I like the fact that this has a magnetic uh, nail set right here where you can get to those high to reach places, start the nail, and then finish it off with a couple more hits right here. I love that. Instead of having to go up and get a ladder, you're able to do that from the ground. That makes it a lot easier for some jobs. Again, whatever can make you more efficient, more productive, that's what I invest in. That's why you buy this hammer because you're saving more time and it's more versatile. Another great thing about these hammers is if you are to somehow crack the face or the waffles are now all worn down, you can replace that easily. It's how you have a place for an Allen key right here. You loosen this up, you can get a new face. Or maybe if you're doing finish work and you want a smooth face, so you're not damaging material, you also can uh, replace it with that. So it's good that you don't have to buy a whole different hammer or may potentially have to change your hammer out for a different job. You can just have another face on you or in your bags or in your bucket. So that makes things a lot easier. Overall, this is a great hammer. This hammer is not gonna make you automatically a journeyman or a quality hand. This is more about just like helping, be, helping you be more effective and maybe putting a little less stress on your body. Again, this is not a Thor situation. You don't just have this hammer and think like, oh man, I'm the shit now. Even though a lot of guys will lead you to believe that, that's not true. So overall, I think this is a great investment yourself. I'm gonna have this hammer for probably five to 10 years. I don't plan on losing it anytime soon. So again, I would much rather buy a quality tool once than have to buy it two or three times in the future. So again, a short review, I love it. I hope you guys like it too. I know a lot of the guys are partial to the Martinez's. I haven't had one before, so maybe if you guys like this video, I might borrow one and do a review on that one also. So let me know. Please uh, like and subscribe. Hit me up the Discord channel. If you have any questions, comment. I reply to all comments. And again, thank you guys. Appreciate you.